Hey family, welcome to the Being Ali Carol Vlogs. I'm Alicia Fernandez and here are we back again on another video. We are heading towards uh, one of those perfect destination. I have been visiting this particular place and uh, yeah, it's something that I'm going to, you know, have a throwback memory when I revisit this place. It's almost I think after 10 years that I'm coming to this place. So Why should I delay? Let's get started and let's head to Bigfoot Lutolim. So guys, it's a beautiful day today. We are on our journey towards our destination and approximately it will take us around an hour or less than that. Bigfoot is located at Lutolim almost around 29 kilometers from the capital city Panjim. The place is scenic and uh, I'm really looking forward to it as this is like almost after 10 years I'll be revisiting this place. And finally we have arrived at our destination Bigfoot Lutolim. Well, we have uh, already purchased our tickets. Usually, it is rupees hundred per person, and it covers four major things, or you could say there are four major highlights of this particular place. First, fully automated tour of Goa of the yesteryears. Second, India's longest record-breaking laterite sculptures. Third, wishing spot. And fourth, the spice medicinal garden. So friends, on a first on a destination, we are heading towards a fully automated tour of Goa of the yester years. This is a miniature Goan village set up to recreate the rural life of old Goa and also the modern Goa. The place has various miniature houses, occupations, fenny distilleries, festival celebrations, all covered over a span of roughly ten to fifteen minutes, and uh, the automated tour. Tells you about the different occupations that Goa had in the yester years and the way how Goa functioned back then. The place is really well maintained and the staff is really too friendly here. They make sure that you feel like very much comfortable and they tell you that you know if you've missed on something, they make sure they you know guide you towards that place right again. And they tell you you know you need to click a picture over here if you have overlooked a particular thing. They make sure that you know they tell you okay. This is the place that you were going to miss, so you need to hurry up so that you can go as per the fully automated tour, which will allow you to understand and at the same time click pictures too. Okay, this place is uh, privately run by an artist called Mahendra Joslino Araujo Alvarez. Indeed, this open air museum recreates Goan life as it was back then, about hundred years ago. After a long walk exploring the various different types of festivals, your know, occupations, all I can say is that I had a really beautiful time over here. And well, this is not it. This was a wishing spot. Indeed, uh, this wishing spot uh, has a lot of success stories. We read a couple of them as we went inside. We also decided we should also wish for something special. As you, I take you along this journey of uh, this particular wishing spot. I request you two can sit back at home and make a wish. Again, I have made my wish. I hope you too made your wish. And uh, now, as we are exploring the interiors of this particular place, I also came across this particular thing. So let's go in and check whether he closes his eyes and smiles. I leave it up to you to decide whether it does or it doesn't. <laughs> After exploring, after exploring this beautiful setup, we now are moving towards uh, the biggest highlight of ancestral Goa, which is not just uh, the highlight of ancestral Goa, but also the biggest highlight of India, because it has a giant 14-meter sculpture of Santa Mirabai, 
the best part about this particular structure was that this was carved within 30 days by Mahendra Joselina Araujo the museum owner and the artist all i can say is that when you look at this particular structure hats off to him what makes it even special is that this completes 25 years in this year and this visit has been amazing and fantastic Uh, there are also a lot of highlights which I have not uh, captured because you need to visit this place because this place is one of the best places. Not just that, we also had a look at the spice and medicinal garden. That is another beautiful place. The journey so far is amazing. We got to see some things which is very, 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 very beautiful. So yes, with this we come to an end of this video. Do let me know what you feel about this video. Have you subscribed to our channel? If not, do subscribe and join to one of the largest growing team on the internet. Subscribe right away. There is a subscribe button. Follow us on Facebook, Twitter. Show in your love and support. Like this video, share this video, and uh, do uh, let other people know about this particular place. And do let me know how do you feel about these videos. I'm so so excited that uh, we are doing something every month and bringing before you videos. A little bit tight crunch at the moment, but yes, we are doing it because uh, I know everybody is waiting for this particular moment. So yes, take care of yourself and keep watching your favorite being Ali Carol vlogs.